Hey everybody and welcome to Bits of Board, where we're talking board games, miniatures, cards and dice. My name is Michael and this is it guys, this is the last of the Kingdom Death expansions. This is the Dragon King expansion and I've been so keen to get to this one, so let's get straight into it. Let's get started. Alright, let's get a look at the box. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> I can already see the minute. Okay, let's go, let's pour it out. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, ignore the giant little thing of miniature that I've got out there. That's all of our other content. All right, let's have a look at these. Ah, this is a weighty one. All right, let's check out the Dragon King. He looks like Bahamut from Final Fantasy. <laughs> That's cool. All right, oh, there's plenty to go over here. Very nice, the glowing crater. Wow. Straight into the showdown, okay. Looks like there's a lot to come though. The meltdown. Just gonna show the pictures, no spoiler. Beautiful, hey. Now I have a feeling that, oh, let's gonna do this in two parts. I have a feeling that this might have uh, another variation on the Kingdom Death campaign. So there was another intimacy event back there and that I think means a new take on the campaign. Wow, so detailed. Oh, it's just so pretty, far out. Tyrant. And yep, here we go. People of the Stars campaign record sheets. That's definitely, that definitely means a new campaign. Awesome, awesome. All right, what else we got? We've got our cardboard punch outs here on one side. We have, I'm not sure what. And on the other side, it looks like we got some magma. Boiling hot liquid magma. Over here, we've got some more punch outs. Very cool, very cool. All right. Into our new settlement locations. Here we go. All right, dividers, ooh, whoa, okay, double dividers here. We've got the Dragon King and the Tyrants. That's two bosses in here, it looks like. We've got the Dragon Armory. And the Throne. Looks like a new starting area, cool. Um, all right, where to, where to? Let's go with the new gear cards. Have a look at these ones. would be the Dragon King cards, so let's have a look at these ones.
this is potentially the Tyrant deck, so let's have a look at these as well. All right, guys, let's do it. Let's check this out. So we've had knights, we've had gods, we've had demons, uh, we've even had a vicious tree, but now we finally have the Dragon King. And I think it's safe to say that now I have run out of room completely. <laughs> no, this expansion is something else entirely, and in my opinion, this is the best Kingdom Death expansion so far. All right, so let's take a look at it. We've got a huge new monster that we can hunt throughout the game. We've got a bunch of new gear and upgrades to help keep the game fresh. I mean, we've even got a whole new campaign to play through, shaking up the base uh, gameplay, just like the Sunstalker expansion did. And this campaign adds a whole new enemy uh, for within, the, the Tyrant, who, from what I've seen here, he's gonna be hard to chase down. He can uh, run in, swipe at you, teleport away. So this adds a whole new layer to your encounter. We've actually gotta consider some of the damage control, uh, as well as, you know, damaging the enemy. As always, the expansion is presented beautifully with some excellent art in the reference book, uh, as well as possibly one of the biggest miniatures I've ever seen in board gaming. Um, I, I seriously, I had to pan out just to get those, uh, the wings into shot. Um, just, whoa. With all the extra content that this expansion brings to the game, this has to top out as the single must-have expansion. A giant dragon, new campaign, tons of cards, it blew me away during the unboxing. So yeah, I'd like to thank you all very much for just saying good day in the comments down there. I mean, whether it was, you know, a bit of advice on how to tackle a boss or just, you know, how I'm doing my hair. Um, thank you very, very much indeed. So as always, um, my name's Michael. This is Bits of Board. We'll catch you next time.